Hello friends, this is Allah, your friendly advisor in Ireland. Welcome back to my channel. The thumbnail might seem like a clickbait, but it's not. This video is specially made for those students who come to Ireland to study master's degree in a number of colleges in Ireland and then search for jobs and end up without jobs, end up without permits and go back to country. This video is specially made for them and it's all about work permits. For a number of years, the limitation for critical skills was 32K. For gender work permit, it was 30K. But these things changed in December 2023. As you all are aware, the people who are in Ireland already studying, they're already aware the critical skills salary limit went from 32k to 38k this year in January 2024 and it will move on to 44k in January 2025. Whereas the general work permit, it went from 30k to 34k in January 2024 and it will move on to 39k in January 2025. As you're already here and you may be aware that, you know, getting this kind of salary without experience is next to impossible only one in hundred or two maybe maximum ten in hundred in a very good job scenario like it was in 2021 and 2022 might get jobs with this kind of salary as you see there's a huge turn turn with respect to I ict employments and other jobs within the market and uh, most of the companies and corporates are you know wait and watch mode and as you see there's a quite hiring that's happening quite hiring actually stands for you know they are not hiring from outside but they are hiring within the firm relocating people from one department to the other department right and there's also firing that's happening as you would have watched uh, my redundancy video which was just previous video to this so the market scenario is not that great on top of that you have the salary limitations of 34k um, which is changing to 39k on general work permit and uh, 38k on critical skills moving on to 44k this only will increase the burden of the people uh, who do not have experience getting those kind of salaries and then further getting work permits 44k for example is a good salary for a three years experience three years experienced guy right but if you work in you know good product company as a starter you may get 45 I don't see any company giving 50k, 60k just for a startup unless until there is a very great need. But the need is not there currently. That's the reason the hiring has slowed down. And uh, it is picking up a bit, but it's not picking up as much as it can. And most of the roles that I see in the market are for experienced folks, not for guys who do not have experience. And imagine you as a student got sold by the consultant back in your country that oh Ireland is great the employment uh, rate is at 99 97% only unemployment is around 3% ICT is booming you know you are you know in in my mother tongue we say popular college net it's basically getting fooled if you are a student with no experience you know it doesn't make sense to come to Ireland and you know trying hard to get those general work permit jobs which pay 39k per annum critical skills job which pay 44k per annum which is very tough right unless you are skilled and have you know experiences so this video do share with those guys who do not have experience because people with experience are finding it hard to get those kind of salaries here as i said a three years experienced technical person may get 44k but that's not the case in other industries so please uh, don't make this mistake of coming to Ireland to, you know, work and make life. If you are, um, you know, not able to get that kind of salary after your master's, right? And uh, the other advice I would probably give you is <clears throat> also educate your friends, educate your family. I know a lot of people bring their family here and uh, even their siblings are finding it hard to get a job. Right. It's not like everyone in Ireland will be, you know, giving you everything in a plate and, you know, ask you to enjoy your life and we'll take care of everything. That doesn't work here. Right. But anyways, if you're a person who is, you know, come, willing to come to Ireland and willing to go back, if nothing works out, 
Mm. You can come and have the experience of living in Ireland, you know, meet nice people, you know, and then make connections. But if you are someone who is purely coming here for job and without job, your family in India will be stressed. Please don't come. Yeah. Thank you for watching this video and do share this with your friends and also subscribe to our channel. And if you have any questions, do write to me at allabotireland247 at gmail.com. I'm always available. Thank you.